Hi, I'm Jin Liu from Cadence. I'm working on the DDR controller support. Today, I'm going to talk about a little bit about uh, the arbitration algorithm in uh, implemented in our controller. So the controller is has two parts, big parts. One is the port, one is the command uh, core, uh, the controller core. So the ports will communicate with the SOC and we call master. So the master will send the request to the port. When the request read or write command get into the port, it will put into the port command queue. Between the port and the core, there is arbitration logic. So arbitration logic will select which command from which port get into the command queue. Because in the core, we have only command queue for all the ports. Um, the simplest one is the round robin algorithm. By name, it, it can you know we can know that it will go through each port every cycle. Port zero, if it has active command and the command queue is now full, it will put the command into the command queue, and then go to the next next port. If it has the active command, then the command queue is now full and we are put into the command queue. Then it go to next port. If that port is idle or quiet, there's no command, it will be skipped and immediately go to the next port. So in this way, it will guarantee that every port, at least for every n cycles, it will be arbitrated. If they have the, if all the ports have the active commands. And if only one command has the command, uh, one port has the command, other ports are all idle, that port, if they has all the, uh, have all the requests, it can guarantee every cycle can be arbitrated. So this is the round robin. So next level, adding a little bit of complexity, is considering the priorities. There's two definitions of the priorities we have. One is the controller-defined port priority, which we can define each port, the read command and read write command with certain priorities. And the other level, the other one is the transaction-based priorities. This is, you know, um, built in the AXI protocol or the Denali protocol. So for each transaction, for each command, they can have its own priorities. So they can be defined by the SOC. Um, the arbitration logic will consider will pick up the the highest priority command from all the ports and put into the command queue if there's space. So what if the, um, for one port, the other command has higher priority, the other port has the command with lower priority? It possibly will be blocked. So we set a limit to define each port. We can set a limit for each port how uh, much percentage they can have the command in the command queue. So if that limit is reached, the arbitration logic will stop to considering uh, that port from, uh, from arbitration. So the lower priority command in the port can be considered. And um, what if there's only one port has command and all other ports are acquired? So if the, it reached the limit, but the command queue is still not full, we can we have another scheme can override the limit. In this case, that command uh, that port can still accepting command and be arbitrated into the command queue. So this is the priority arbitration. The third scheme is uh, adding a little bit more um, complexity is we call it weighted round robin. The weighted round robin is has three steps. First. It will put the command into the different priority group. If you consider all the ports for the command, priority 0, 1, or 2. So in each priority group, the ports from different, uh, the command from different ports, we can give that port uh, some weightings. So if we, we're going to port 1 with higher weighted than the port 0, so the port one command with the same priority will be uh, have more opportunity to 
op more opportunity to be put into the command queue. So this is the weighted run robbing. So this is more complex one. The algorithm, you know, which algorithm you will select is based on your system requirement and also be considering, you know, the more complex, the more difficulty in the implementations. You know, you have to consider in the area, the time enclosure and the, the congestions, you know, will be go higher, especially if you have more ports. Um, that's all for today's arbitration concept. Thank you for watching. I'm Jing Liu and uh, this is Whiteboard Wednesday. Thank you. Mm -hmm.